Helen Zhao spent nine years as a professional boxer before becoming a referee in the sport. In her career as a champion boxer, she won all 14 of her matches before deciding to take on a new challenge. She recalls officiating her first ever match where her confidence, she says, played a large part in gaining respect in a male-dominated sport. The audience was baffled. Why would a woman officiate this match? And she doesn't even look intimidating. Can she be strong? A difficult scenario ensued. That would have resulted in any other referee stepping aside. But I controlled the situation and successfully concluded my work. Helen has officiated more than 10 matches, including World Boxing Federation fights featuring Hassan Moquinho, Africa's number one super welterweight boxer. However, despite such milestones, she says it might take a while before being a female boxing referee is a financially rewarding endeavor. In refereeing, there is still a challenge when it comes to pay. I can't lie. I can't say that we are paid well. No, pay is meager compared to the work we do. We work hard and earn little, but we are grateful even for that. Figures on the exact number of female boxing referees around the world are hard to come by. Helen says she's only laid eyes on a handful of referees around the East African region, attesting to their low numbers. For decades, sports have been heavily dominated by men. It's only last year that the Olympic Games had women make up 49% of all athletes. Some sportswomen like Helen believe that increased financial incentives may be the key to increasing women's participation in sports. Helen's longtime trainer and sparring partner says African traditions have contributed to keeping many women on the continent out of occupations such as refereeing. There are some jobs that were viewed as not fit for women and a preserve of men, but this was a lie. As days go on, and with the world changing, we now see women with higher education levels and sportswomen with even greater abilities than their male counterparts. Helen dreams of officiating major bouts on the African continent and elsewhere around the world. She also wants to see referees in her favorite sport. To do that, she's passing on her knowledge to the next generation of sportswomen. Isaac Lukando, CGTN. Dar es Salaam.